Hi, I'm Carrie. And I'm Dave. This is EW's TV Recaps for April 4th. After last week's lukewarm episode, Scandal returned last night with some huge <laughs> crazy moments. The oh biggest God. being that Olivia pulled the plug on B613, who was monitoring her mother, which led to this. You just killed the president. John Wilkes Booth, Lee Harvey Oswald, Olivia Pope, all the assassins. This is just the kind of thing that happens when you try and stop your parents from stabbing each other with steak knives while out to dinner at a fancy restaurant. Two years in prison, you know what I missed most of all? Really good wine. Hey, you know what goes well with a really good wine? Wrist! As in Olivia's mom chewed through her wrist that time, and I still can't forget Oh, it. neither can I. Oh, gosh. Uh -huh. I don't think I'll ever forget Olivia asking Fitz if he should be the man for whom she fluffs. Stop! Am I your fluffer today, Fitz? Is that what I am? Personally, I'm just mad at all the fluffing Olivia's been doing these days. Hey, drunk Scott Foley, FYI, if you come knocking on my door late at night, I'm going to let you in with open arms. Speaking of open arms, how about the moment Melly slapped her husband because he took her boyfriend away? You take everything from me! Sorry, I'm on Team Melly here. I'm getting tired of Fitz and his bitch assness. Like, why does he get to have a mistress and she can't have a mister? It's such a BS double standard. If you're gonna cheat, then everyone should get to cheat, okay? Maybe I'm just old fashioned when it comes to relationships. You know, when it comes to dating, I think Quinn's got it all figured out. There was Jesse. Why should Jesse break up? He died in an explosion. And there was Gideon, also dead, scissors. And now you. See? She has options. Uh, not live ones, though. <laughs> what a great episode. But, like, how do they expect us to tweet about a scandal cliffhanger if they don't give us an official hashtag? Oh, how about a uh, hashtag who got bombed? But how does that tell us whether the president has a breadstick or a baguette? Okay, so a different cliffhanger. Subscribe, guys. Follow us on Twitter. It's probably like one of those little pretzel nuggets.